Hello my lovelies, it is Aurora Sims and welcome back to my channel for part number three of the Sims 3 anniversary. <laughs> So, you guys, I just want to let you know it is kind of late in the day and I tried to record Generations and I just couldn't. It was having too many issues and I wasn't dealing with it. So I'm just letting you know um, that my family might be loud, so this video is going to be extremely edited out, hopefully. I'm hoping I can get this video recorded and done with because I know I owe you guys that. Um, I just don't want to post no half-done video. Like, I'm just not about that life. But I promise you guys a video. So... I'ma post it, okay? Um, so anyways, in the previous part of the university life, we actually went to, oh my god, I don't know what the hell my voice just did there, but it was gross. Sophia's actually on her way to the dorms, which is good. She's heading there. Uh, the game may be a little bit laggy because I just started it up, so of course it's going to lag just a little bit here and there. Um, let's go ahead and see what's going on over here. Who are these people? I'm pretty sure these people are not in our dorm. Like, I'm like 99.9% .9 sure. Um, let's go ahead. Sophia is about to have some food here because she is a little bit hungry. So she's going to make herself some tofu dogs. Um, and then we do have class tomorrow, of course, because it's Monday. And I did want to go ahead and throw a party. I totally forgot. But the girls are a little bit tired, but we might do it anyways. Like, who cares? All right, so um, I want to throw a kegger. Hopefully, we can throw one and it's not too late. Um, but let's go ahead and, yeah, okay, it looks like we're good. Okay, we're going to invite our roommates, of course. We'll invite Jeffrey Dean. We'll invite this guy. Um, we'll invite Millie and Tammy Parker. We'll invite Debbie. Just a bunch of random people that live in the dorm. Um, this girl is a teacher, so we don't want her invited. And then, we're, of course, we're going to invite our roommates and this guy and Tiffany. Okay, and I think that's good. So, yeah, we're going to throw a kegger. We have never thrown a party before, so this is going to be very, very interesting. I'm really excited. Apparently, we have a new roommate. This girl is our new roommate, so, of course, we need to give her a makeover as well. Um, her name is Shay. So let's go ahead and get ourselves a keg. And we have another roommate. Where are all these random people coming from? Uh, maybe they're not our roommates and they're just kind of here. Okay, so let's buy a keg, which I think is in parties. Okay, yeah, it's right here. Okay, so really all we need for this party is a keg and maybe some music. So I'm going to go ahead and see if we have like a stereo or something. No, we do not. So we'll just take one and put one in the corner. Um, where do I get that? Okay, yeah. Electronics, and we are going to just put a stereo in the corner. Perfect. Okay. And we're going to have us a little kegger. I think it'll be fun. So I'm excited. I kind of like to get two keggers, though, because it's kind of annoying having, like, 50 people around one keg. So I'm going to put this one here as well. I'm going to have two keggers. We can have the ultimate kegger party. Okay, so she's really hungry. Let's go ahead and order a pizza for the party call for services and we're going to order a p-i-z-z-a pizza 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 okay pizza delivery perfect and our first party guest has already arrived that's crazy let's go ahead and turn on the music and we are going to change the music to um i guess pop let's go ahead and really quickly i need to turn the music back on and we're also going to turn off high free will because I don't want them to just be doing whatever they want. So anyways, these are the people that were invited. Millie's here, which we don't like her. Um, Tiberius is here. We've got Tammy Parker, which her hair is really weird. I need to change that. And we've also got uh, this guy and then this girl here who, as I said, I really do think she's our new roommate or something. I don't know. But anyways, um... Katrina, come over here and get you some juice, man. This is your freaking kegger, and you're not getting juice. Actually, it's Sophia's keg kegger, but whatever. Okay, listen, we get it. Move out of the way, Millie. Move. You're so annoying. I don't like her. Move, girl. Please. Please move. Thank you. I don't want to have to get this girl to fight you, too. We do not want that. Okay, so Katrina's going to go ahead and get her first drink. 
get your drink why are you being so complicated okay of course it's the freaking full moon i hate full moons in this game like so annoying but whatever go ahead and get your juice girl don't let anybody ruin your juicy day all right she's getting her juice and we're just gonna kind of drink it and chill out for a little bit let me see where Sophia's at. She's just kind of here. She is actually really hungry, but, um, or she just ate. Not that she's hungry. Okay, let's go ahead and chat with, um, Katrina. There's already a girl over here freaking, um, streaking. That's ridiculous. Okay, let's get a dare. Oh, wait, here's the pizza. Okay. Ooh, the pizza man's interested. Ooh. This girl's getting it for some reason. Uh, this zombie needs to go away. Sorry, not sorry, but I'm not dealing with you right now, so you need to go home. All right, uh, let's check the job board for a dare for Sophia to do. I feel like she would definitely be into dares. Oh, wait, no, 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 that's Katrina's job. I forgot she's a daredevil. So let's go ahead and get Katrina to come over here and check for some dares. And let's see, Sophia, what are you doing? You're just going to wait for the pizza. Oh, let's talk to this guy. He's a little bit stinky, but we'll still introduce ourselves because I don't even think we've introduced ourselves to him, and he is one of our roommates. So drink, drink three energy drinks. Uh, No, let's do a dare that involves, like, something that is related to this party because that would be really fun. Uh, Eat raw cinnamon. No, that one's dumb, too. Oh, man. We ran out of stuff. Dang it. Okay. Um, okay, let's get let Sophia give us a dare then. Let's uh let's see. Friendly. And can we dare her to do something? Let's see. Or let's just be friendly and talk to her a little bit. Um and really girl, you change it to your bathing suit, really? You think anybody wants to see that? I'm just saying, whatever. I'm just gonna let her be. <laughs> okay, let's convince her to... Well, first we gotta be friends, because I don't think we can convince her to do anything yet. We're gonna go ahead and do a keg stand together. Let's see. Katrina. Alright, and then of course Jeffrey Dean's here, and he's a freaking wolf. Oh, I hate Supernatural in this game. I hate it in, like, anything that's not Supernatural related. It's really annoying. Okay. So, her and her bathing suit is very promiscuous, I'm just saying. Girl, can you put on regular clothes? Alright, anyway, so I'm gonna... Oh god, that music is so loud, holy crap. Um, Hip-hop, there we go. Come on. Of course, the wolf is stripping. Move, guys, so we can do a keg stand. Okay, fine. We'll do a keg stand with Katrina over here. We'll refill the keg so we can do a keg stand come on move out of the way oh my god this is why i like having 50 different kegs because it's so annoying when people take over the kegs oh my god this music is so loud why is there so many radios going on right now who's who has another radio going on because i'm pretty sure we're the only one it should have a radio going so like where is the other one that's what i would like to know um i don't see it anywhere maybe it's outside or something i don't know turn it off okay i'm missing their keg stand they didn't even do it are you kidding me where is this noise it's so annoying where is it Okay, maybe it's upstairs somewhere, like over here. See, like somebody's cheating. Oh, okay, it's over here. It's over here somewhere. There's like a radio here or something, or like up here. I'm not crazy, guys. I swear there's like something other than what we have playing. Okay, there we go. There's two different radios on. That's why all these radios are on the heck okay there only needs to be one radio on and that's this one okay oh they're doing their keg stand wait we're missing it oh so cute okay all right let's go ahead and cute okay so it's 12 which is really late and especially since it's a monday 
Um, we're gonna go ahead and serve the pizza called to meal everyone. Of course, Sophia's got a freaking phone call. Let's go ahead and answer our phone and see who is a Colin. Who's Colin? Who is a girl? No one of importance, probably. Nope, I knew it. Okay. <gasps> oh my gosh, the police are on their way to Sophia Cruz's juice kegger. Better break it up. Oh my god. Oh my god. How do we do this? I think we have to talk to one of the guests that we invited. Or we click on her, I think. I've never had, I don't remember. It's been such a long time since I've had the police come to a kegger. Um, do, do, do. How do I, how do I end the party? I'm pretty sure there's a way to do it. Oh, I think we could do it with her and be like, hey, you gotta leave, bro. Uh, I don't know how to get everybody to leave. Oh, break up party, there we go. All right, guys, you gotta hurry. The police are coming. Hurry up. We can't have y'all here when the police get here because then we're gonna have to pay a fine. Get out. She's like, get out. Are you guys crazy? Get out of my house. Stop eating my food. <laughs> oh my God. Okay. Hey, nice party. Gotta go. Good. Leave. This party was a big fat fail. Okay, let's go upstairs. And um, she needs to go ahead and use the bathroom. Katrina can go ahead and go to bed. I don't know who keeps putting their beds up or putting, yeah, putting their beds up because it scares me whenever they do that because then it's like you can die from it. So it makes me really nervous. Yeah, I know. We threw a lame party. I know. It was lame. I understand. I usually throw great parties, but you know whatever we had to break up the party or the police would have came so it had to be lame or you know would have gotten in trouble and i'm not trying to spend any money on that so maybe you know katrina needs to throw the party next time maybe sophia is not party material because let's think like rachel berry if you think about rachel berry from glee throwing a party like no one would go to that so i feel like you know sophia's the same way like people don't really take her seriously and i feel like she definitely would not be good at throwing parties so maybe next time we'll get katrina to throw the party because i feel like it'll be a lot better with her throwing it okay anyways you guys what i'm gonna let them do is i'm gonna go ahead and let them sleep and i will see you all in the morning when they wake up all right, good morning, you guys. So Katrina is the first one up and ready for the day. We're gonna go ahead and get her ready for class. She's going to head in the shower really quick and then go ahead and uh, use the bathroom. All of these bathrooms are clogged. Like, are you kidding me? Guess we're gonna use a clogged toilet then because the only thing I also hate about university and like not having your own place is that people clog up stuff and no one cleans anything and it's just really annoying. Um, so what I think that we're going to do today is I kind of want to look into what Katrina's like major is, which I forgot what it, oh, technology, right. So I kind of want to look into maybe working with this brain stimulizer, which I still haven't made up their bedroom and I am going to do before the next part. So yeah, I just completely forgot about it. If you want me to be completely honest, uh, let's go ahead and put her brain thing outside and maybe she can work with that just a little bit because she does have an interactive class today. So I kind of want to get her grades up because I feel like she could definitely, definitely do that. So we're going to study the brain and do all of that stuff after she's done getting ready. And then she should be good. So let's also check on mrs sophia here i think maybe sophia's gonna head to the grotto this morning and maybe get something to eat or maybe meet some new people whatever but she's definitely going to head to the grotto so we're gonna go there maybe have some morning coffee and maybe a donut and talk to a few people and of course katrina's like freaking out because of how freaking dirty this bathroom is i don't blame you girl i do not blame you and of course, she's wearing her little sexy dress of freaking course. People turning on this music, girl. It is too early for all that. Like, really? Why does everybody turn on like 50 radios? Are you kidding me? Shut up, Millie. This is why I don't like you. All right, anyways. Um, okay. So Katrina is going to work with this brain thing here. Sophia has successfully made it to the grotto. There's a few people here already, um, but I think she's just going to go and grab her coffee. 
So let's get a white chocolate latte cappuccino with extra foam. Go ahead and grab it, girl. Because we need it. We need that extra energy for class today. Are you serious? Did this guy really just walk away from his post while we're trying to get a drink? Oh, I hate when they do that. You're not even cleaning anything, bro. Give me my drink. All right, she's coming over here. Hopefully, he will serve us. And if not, then we'll go to this guy. So, come on. Give us our drink, homie. Yes, thank you, boo. So, he kind of looks creepy. Are you kidding me? No, I want my coffee. Give me my coffee. Thank you. We're going to drink it. So, thank you. Are you kidding me? <laughs> All right, let me try one more time. This is ridiculous. All right, get your drink. I know you have class in two hours, but you're thirsty and you need a drink. We've been we've been hoping for this coffee, so we're going to have it. So you each drink your coffee. Um, let's check on our girl here, see what she's up to. Kind of want to just keep her working on the um, brain thing so that she can kind of get her performance up just a little bit until she has to go to class. And did you drink your coffee? oh my god this is ridiculous like are we seriously not getting our drink you know what he's giving terrible service so you know what our girl's gonna do she's gonna tell him off okay tell him off be like i have paid for two coffees and all of them have disappeared <laughs> are you kidding me like are you serious bro i want my freaking coffees accuse him of being a diva no he's trying to be nice like no i'm not gonna listen to you i don't want your stupid deals i want my coffee and you are the worst barista ever first you walk away when i'm trying to order and then you don't give me my coffee twice like this is ridiculous i'm going to class screw this guy we don't need coffee we don't need him make our own freaking coffee it doesn't even matter all right let's check on katrina and see what she's up to she's still studying her own brain super cute i love this i'm scared that something's gonna happen to her though oh my god she looks so cute in her dress okay i hope nothing happens to her i really don't i really pray that nothing happens to her because i've had my sim get electrocuted from doing this but i don't remember if he was studying the brain or if he was doing brain enhancement but i know that he for sure got electrocuted and I was not having it. Uh, let's get Katrina to come over here and talk to Tiffany. Kind of see what she's up to. Because we haven't really talked to her in a while. And I know that um, Sophia's actually kind of cool with Tiffany. But I'm going to get Katrina to have some friend. Like, she needs to know somebody. So let's get her to talk. And we need to give this lady a makeover. Like, I'm still focused on that. But anyways, come on, girl and okay she's in class so we're just gonna let her do that and they're just talking i love her freaking outfit okay let's chat with her and shaka bra we're gonna talk about university just ask her how she's doing ask her how life is what's been up gonna ask about her age ask about her Let's ask about her gender preference. I mean, I don't know why we would ask that, but we're going to ask anyways. So their relationship has improved somewhat. So she's making a few jokes to Tiffany and just kind of talking until her class starts, which is actually really soon. And she is kind of hungry. So we're going to go ahead and get her to eat this candy bar before she heads off to class because she is a hungry beaver. So let's just kind of continue our conversation. And then we're going to eat this chocolate bar and head to class because we do need to go ahead and go um and that that chocolate bar i could already tell probably made her sick um anyway she has her class at the comic book store let's go ahead and check on sophia she is heading home um so i think when she gets home she's going to grab something to eat and then um we're gonna focus back on our other girls so let's grab some green salad and i'm gonna let sophia maybe study a little bit because her grades are kind of slipping so we're gonna study and Katrina is at the comic book store I'm guessing that she's doing brain enhancement with her class there are a few people here that are in her class they're pretty cute though there's a lot of old men 
A lot of old men. Ooh, who is this guy? Steve Texas. Let's see what he looks like. Uh, he's interesting. He kind of looks like our roommate, but let's go ahead and talk to him anyways. Oh, and Tiffany has the same major as us. That's cool. Okay. Either that or she's just going to the comic book store to visit. Which is also, which also makes sense. Oh no, we left our brain enhancement thing at home, so we can't even play with it. Oh. Okay, well, let's talk to this guy. Let's introduce ourselves to this Sid guy. I don't like his facial hair, but he's kind of cute if he didn't have that. So, we're gonna say hello, we're gonna be friendly and chat with him. Oh, apparently he's interested. Ooh, well, let's tell him a funny story. I feel like he's the type of guy that would date Katrina. Honestly and truly, I do. Definitely think so. Let's talk about university. And get to know him. Because obviously we can't do anything in class because we left our freaking device at home, which was a stupid idea. And I know that we could probably go back to campus and, you know, get our device, but whatever. All right, so we're just talking, telling him a funny story. He's cool. Let's enthuse about comic, comic books. Um, a lot of you guys were saying in the last part that you think that Katrina could definitely be a rebel. And girl, I see that like I don't see nothing in this world. Like I definitely see her being a freaking rebel. I could see it totally. And I love you guys' input on what you like see in her future. I don't know why. I just love that stuff. So thank you for leaving your um, suggestions. Because honestly with this series sometimes I get stuck on what I want to do because it's like everything has already been done with the Sims 3 University so it's just kind of like difficult because it's like the same thing over and over and over again so I don't know um let's be friendly and ask his sign just kind of do all of that stuff a lot of you guys were also saying that you think that Sophia should blog which I would love to do that so leave me some names that we should name her blog like for Sophia's blog, leave me some names down below for what we should name the blog and like things like that because I feel like that would be really interesting and we could like take photos for the vlog and things like that. That would be pretty fun. Okay, so let's talk about art. They're kind of hitting it off, honestly and truly. I mean, he hasn't been rude to her or anything. He's just continuously talking to her, which is nice. Let's check on our girl here, the girl at home that ain't doing a dang thing. Um, she needs to take a quick shower. Okay, let's hop up in the shower. And she feels like she is being small talked right now. <laughs> oh my god. Anyways, you guys, uh, I think that we are actually running out of time. That is the most flattering face on the planet. She's like, yes! Anyways, you guys, uh, I think I am going to go ahead and end this part right on here. Leave me some comments down below on what you think we should name Sophia's blog. Also, let me know what you think about Mr. Sid here. Are you interested? Do you think he's cute? Let me just kind of show you guys what he looks like again real quick. Anyways, you guys, I love you all so, so very much. I hope you enjoyed this video. I know it was probably all over the place, but um, I had to get a video out for you guys today because I promised that I would have a Sims video out and I woke up late and I didn't get the time to record and I had to do, do the stream. And so I'm really, really sorry. But anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed and I will catch you all uh, tomorrow, maybe. I don't know for my very next video. Bye guys.